Hey everyone, so before I start this video, I just want to say thank you. I appreciate all the support and comments I got on my last video. Like honestly, you guys are the best. Now, I wasn't planning on not posting for as long as I did, but my goal now is to be on a normal schedule for posting and hopefully having posting like at least once a week. And if anything happens where I don't fulfill that, I'll definitely make sure to let you guys know where I'll just comment on my most recent video and have it pinned to the very top so you guys can see it. And also I made a Twitter that I'll put the link into the description to keep you guys updated with new things I'm working on or when the next video I'm working on will be released and also like little snippets of it and stuff like that. I especially want to start posting more because of the new episode that's about to start in Valorant along with the new agent and I'm going to make a video on him soon. He seems really interesting and I'm curious how he's going to fit into the meta and if he'll change anything or if he won't really matter at all but he definitely seems interesting and I want to take a look at him but besides all that I hope you guys enjoy the video and let's jump straight into the viper guide for the new icebox. To start off, I'm going to show you a post-plant model lineup for a default. To do this, all you have to do is be at the second doorway at A Lobby. Then you're going to want to line your crosser up in the very middle of this bar at the wall. Come against the wall, and then point your crosser right up at the ceiling at this line that intersects with the ramp. Have your crosser off the ramp just a bit, and then shoot. What this model will do is hit the back of the wall of A site and then land at default. To smoke off heaven on A site, you want to come to the same wall as the model lineup, and then look at this line at the very edge. Come against the wall, and then point your crosser at the first edge of this wall right here. Line your crosser up, and then do a jump throw. A good wall for ASA is on these boxes right here. What you're going to want to do is line up your wall on your map so it blocks off the doorway to an A nest. With the new changes to Icebox and this wall and smoke, pushing ASA becomes a lot easier. This is what the wall and smoke looks like paired together. When defending an A-site, I like to throw up a wall that blocks off pipes, nest, and heaven. Now when I do this wall, I make sure I line up on my map so it blocks off all three, and then I just cut it across diagonally. When I do this, I make sure to look up so that way it reaches all the spots. This wall is nice because it blocks off basically every single angle to A-site, and also allows you to push up and be aggressive if you want to be. If you want to smoke off boiler and attack inside, all you have to do is come up to this wall and be in the middle of this site right here. Then put your crosser at the top and between these two boxes. After that, just do a normal jump throw. If you want to combo that smoke with a wall so you can attack A site from mid, all you have to do is come up into the middle of this light right here, and then using the ball of your wall, put it in the middle of the circle. Then shoot your wall. With the wall and smoke together, you can block off any angle from underpass, Mid boiler, and anyone playing CT or kitchen. For the wall for attacking B site, you're going to want to have first cleared out B main before you throw it up. To put it up, all you have to do is just come up to this line right here between these two boxes, and then on your map, line it up so it blocks off any angle from Ness, Mid, and Snowman. To my B default, all I have to do is come into the cubby of B main, and it's really important that you line yourself up against the wall and the pipes, and not just in the middle of the pipes, because that'll mess up the lineup. You want to make sure you come against the glass wall, and then come against the pipes as well. Bring your crosser to the end of this black line, along this orange bar, and then raise it up to the white. After that, do a jump shoot. When the fan B site, the wall I use goes straight down the middle of site and then also blocks off line of sight from anyone trying to push B to mid or anyone that's pushing B main. Personally, I love using one ways as Viper. I feel like they're really powerful. And if you want to do a one way for B main, all I have to do is come over to these two boxes right here and come directly in the middle of them. Point your crosser at the bottom of the edge of this little dark jet out right here, and then do a jumping right click. Thank you guys for watching, and I really hope you enjoyed the video. 
If there's any lineups that you know of that I didn't show in this video, be sure to let me know in the comments down below. Or if there's anything you want to talk about Valorant or any questions you have about it, feel free to ask me in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.